is your boy Donnie the Dreamer, and we are giving you another Elden Ring video. We're gonna try to take out Merlet the Fell Omen. And joining me today is playing as Furled Finger Fenrir, my co collaborator, my co conspirator for the Pop Culture Academy podcast, Dr. X. How you doing today, brother? <laughs> good, good, good. All right. Ready to uh, put this guy in the bed. So. Yeah. Ready to kick some tail, take some names, and uh, I guess you could say dispel a fell omen. So, yeah, let's get into it. All right. Now, he's the first big bad that we really have to try to tackle with. Look at this guy. This guy's a Chad. <laughs> Straight up Chad. Alright. Try to pick him off with some some throwing dagger knives. Oof. Alright, get that crit. Alright, get him up, get him up. You know, I kinda wish you could stomp him out. Like in Don't Be a Menace. <laughs> Take some pot shots while he's on the floor. All right, we're at the halfway point. Watch out for the daggers. Ooh. Watch out. Yep, gotta watch that hammer. Get that crit, get that crit. Back off a little bit. Ooh. Ah, yeah. Margaret the fell omen. Down for the count. Oh, yeah. Well. Yep, we made that look easy. Yeah, yeah. First of all, that was cryptic as that was cryptic as hell. It, it, even when he's dying, he's threatening my life. <laughs> That's pretty wild. Well, he is the uh, he is of the royal guard of the family. Okay, okay. Uh, about to meet him. <laughs> you know, he is like the last defense of this castle. Gotcha. So. Which is Castle Storm. Uh, was it Stormvale? Castle Stormvale. Yep. So, yeah, that was uh, Merlet the Fell Omen. The first approachable boss, I would say. That seems fair. You know? <laughs> You know, and by fair, I mean, like, you should be scaled to him at this point. Even though I needed a little bit of help, like, uh, you should be, like, well into, like, your first couple of hours where it doesn't feel like it's an unfair challenge. As opposed to, you know, the tree sentinel. That smug bastard. <laughs> yeah, or even the very first boss that you fight. Yeah. In your, I wouldn't call it the tutorial area. I mean, it literally teaches you nothing. <laughs> well, that, that's that's the irony of uh, Souls games is that, you know, they throw you like waist deep into the pool. Um, I was actually talking to a friend of mine about it. Like I was like telling him about the game, and I was like, yeah. So you know how like in Dark Souls, like when you first start the game, they're like little messages that give you a rundown of how to move and like you know what the actions are. They don't do that here. <laughs> they they don't do that at all. No. You get none of that. Nothing. It's best to view in the very beginning. Mm -hmm. No enemies. Just yeah. test out the buttons. Yep. You got you to gotta figure it out for yourself. They're like, oh, nah. So, like, the next Souls game, like, the next big Souls game from some from software, 
uh, most likely what's going to happen is you're going to start the game and then you're immediately going to encounter a boss and die. And that's how the game's going to start. Like, yeah. It wouldn't, wouldn't be a Souls game if they in, didn't introduce you to the mechanic that you was going to be most familiar with. Right. And that's death. Yeah, so they I, have to kill you in the beginning. Yeah, death and rebirth. Show you that, hey, Absolutely. Yeah, that's how it happens. <laughs> That's the that's the fun. Now you come back, come better. Yeah. Continue moving on. Yeah, yeah. All right. So yeah, that was a uh, Merlet the Fell Omen. I'll give you guys some more boss battle content a little bit later. Uh, sorry, it was such a short video, but you know what can I say? We get busy. So, <laughs> Doctor X, thanks for joining me. And uh, anytime, anytime. Yeah. So we'll catch you guys in the next video. Catch us, up, catch us up on the Pop Culture Academy podcast, episode three on YouTube. Follow me on Twitch and YouTube, Donnie the Dreamer. And on Twitch, Donnie the Dreamer, threes with, instead of ease. Yeah, catch you guys next time. Peace.